Hey, everybody in here. This morning, I'm on a mission. Whew, it is already heating up. This is the last day of the heat wave. If I can make it through today, I can make it through anything. Anyhow, I'm on a mission. I found some mushrooms on a neighbor's property, and I'm going to go see if I can harvest them, and hopefully they won't shoot me. Look at what we've got here. These are two clusters of beautiful honey mushrooms. Those, a couple days ago, were already past their prime. These were just little tiny, tiny ones. I should have came back yesterday to harvest them, um, but I didn't. But I am going to take this whole cluster and just see if there's any of them that are salvageable. Nope, unfortunately, a day late and a dollar short. It's already infested through and through with maggots. Um, so, yeah, we won't be taking this into the tiny house. That's such a shame. If I had just gotten here a day earlier, I would have been able to harvest these and dehydrate them. That is a crying shame. Yeah, I knew, I knew I should have gone back yesterday because those go bad pretty gosh darn quickly. I checked all the other stumps on the property and no more honey mushrooms, but at least I know they're coming up. So I harvested a few clusters from my property last year. So I'm hoping they'll crop up somewhere on my property so I can harvest them and dry them out. So how about instead we just look at these beautiful prezzies that I got. Prezi number one is Healthy Harvest 16% layer pellets. This was ordered for me by Miss Sarah off of my Walmart wish list. Little bit of drama involving this. The FedEx driver um, <laughs> delivered it to the wrong place, but I was able to get it. So look, yep, 40 pounds. Thank you so much, Sarah. This helped because I was totally out of layer feed. Look at this, you guys. This comes from Miss Vicky. Vicky, I think it's Drain. And she got me these fence posts. And they're U posts. They're plenty tall. There's 10 of them. So I am going to be able to finish the rooster yard. Thank you so, so very much for these. I needed them. I've got the chicken wire. So I am ready to go as soon as it cools off, that is. And then there's this box. Look at Papa. What are you doing over there, Papa? You're a good boy. Let me show you what's in this box. Bar and chain oil and a brand new chain from a chainsaw. This comes from Miss Donna B. Thank you so, so very much. I think you noticed that when I was learning how to use, cut over that saw book, I, for a couple cuts that I made, the chain went down onto the metal frame and it kind of hosed the other chain up. I may be able to sharpen it. I don't know. I don't even know how to do that yet. But this is going to get me back in action very soon. Once it, uh, after this day, when it starts cooling off again, I'm going to go out and chop me up some more wood. Thank you so very much. And that right there is a beautiful, beautiful rug. It's one of two that Sarah ordered for me. One came today. I'm not going to unfold it and show it to you right now because I need to sweep the floor because it's uh, got stuff on it. And uh, so what I'm going to do is once I get the other one, get this place all kind of straightened out and then do like a little mini tour so you can see these beautiful rugs. Papa don't care if the floor is dirty. He just wants to stay cool. Yep, it's time for me to go crank up the generator. This is the hourly weather forecast for today. It's about 94. It's going to get up to 96, but it's going to feel like it's over 100. It doesn't start cooling down until after 6 p.m. But here is the weekly. Um, so tomorrow it's going to be 77, and we've got one more day of heat, and then it's going to be smooth sailing from there on out. All three of these jars sealed perfectly, absolutely perfectly. Yes, indeed. And even the one with the extra brine, completely sealed. So I'm getting pretty good at this whole canning stuff. It's lunchtime. Ham and cowboy candy wraps. Delicious. I got the generator going and the air conditioner going. It's starting to cool down in here. Oh, this heat just exhausts me. Uh, so nothing else is going to go on. I've been going out and checking the chickens about once an hour and for right now, I think I'm going to lay down and take a nap. I'm going to try because it's, it's comfortable in here. 
So, yeah, like I said, nothing else is going on. So that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.